The number three is synonymous with Chris Paul, but CP3's third All-Star game is different. Three isn't a charm where it's tough for your star to shine when you can't play. Tough, really tough, because I, I love to play all day, every day anyway. So to not to be able to play in this game with all these great players and enjoy it and have fun, it's going to be tough, but I know it's a process. He's not playing, but the Hornets' Lone Star is still in the Lone Star State supporting his teammates on the West Squad. CP3 is also here in Dallas rehabbing his left knee, which is gaining strength by the day. Are we going to see you back on the court, you think? As soon as possible. You know, Doc said four to six weeks, so uh, I'm just trying to do my rehab as much as possible. So Chris Paul may not be playing in this All-Star game, but if you ask the players, well, they can't say enough about CP3. He just doesn't have any weaknesses, man. I mean, he's, he's tough. He's, he's hard-nosed. Um, he's a modern-day Isaiah Thomas. He's everything, you know, a, a coach dreams because he can, you know, not only play, but he can lead a team. He's a, he's a coach out there on the floor. He's, for me, the best point guard in the game. Uh, you know, his ability to score so effectively and, and obviously set people up is uh, amazing. When you hear a compliment like that from somebody like him, how does it make you feel? I paid Steve to say that. You know what I mean? So now I gotta now I got to figure out how much that's going to cost me. He's just got the heart of a, of a champion. You know, he just doesn't back down from anything. You know, you can say he has a small man's yeah. complex because he just, he just has a chip yeah. on his shoulder. It's helped him though, right? Yeah, because he is small. I've been undersized my entire life, and that may be why, you know, I play so mad and frustrated and stuff like that. But all in all, I just want to have fun, and most of all, I want to win. He's a winner, so, you know, he's got all the attributes, and he's going to have a phenomenal career. So Paul has respect from his peers and bragging rights to boot. He's the only all-star who can say he lives in the home of the Super Bowl champs. This from a Super Saints fan. Excited. Excited. The city is crazy. Um, I think it may be the biggest thing that ever happened in New Orleans right now, the way it brought everybody together. And uh, that team and those guys, they all deserve it. Hornets fans feel they deserve their man back soon. Chris Paul hopes to oblige sooner than later. In Dallas, Mike Neighbors for CST Tonight.